Kyocera offers a software program for Windows computers to easily set paper trays remotely. First, go to the Kyocera DocumentSolutions.us website. Now select Support from the upper menu bar. Select Download Center. From the Choose an Option page, scroll to or type P2235DW to select your Kyocera printer. Select Ecosys P2235DW from the selections. Scroll down to the Drivers, Documents, and Software title bar and select Software. Look for Configuration Tool and press the blue down arrow button to the right. The Configuration Tool software will download. Once the configtool.zip file is downloaded, click on the downloaded icon to unzip it. The computer should now open a new window and show the config tool folder. Double click on the folder. You should now see three files. Lang, the utility KM Utility Config 2, and a configuration settings file. Click on the application KM Util Config 2. You'll be presented with the Select a Driver Splash screen. From the pull-down, select the Kyocera Ecosys P2235DW KX driver from the list. If this choice is not available, you will need to install the KX driver first and restart the program to continue. Select the P2235DW KX driver and press Next. The machine will now attempt to connect to the device. This may take a minute or two, so please be patient. You'll now be presented with the Device Defaults and Device Overview tabs. Let's start with Device Defaults. We will concentrate on Media Paper located on the lower part of the configuration page. First is Paper Source. You can select from the pull-down either MP Tray, which is the tray shown here, or Cassette 1, which is shown here. We will first set the MP Tray. We can select Paper Size. The default is letter, however the MP tray can successfully feed a wide variety of paper. If you have an unusual paper size or weight, the MP tray can handle it. Select the paper size from whatever is printed on the box. Next, set the media type. This too is printed on the box the paper came in. Proper size and media type are important as this will affect proper paper feed as well as image quality. Lastly, you can select paper weight. This choice allows you to refine image quality, further enhancing the media type. Use this setting when you're not satisfied with a specific output. Images are darker with the higher settings. You can now go to Paper Source Cassette 1 and set paper size, media type, and weight here. We recommend you set this to paper size as letter, media type plain, and paper type normal too. These are settings for standard size and weight for typical copier paper. Now press Apply to set the machine's paper settings. Press OK to exit the program. To learn how to load paper into the MP tray and cassette, view the Adding Paper video.